he said, uh, I've been a support volunteer for several years. The best advice I received was to tell people um, that what they're feel feeling is normal. It gets easier over time and normality will return. Thanks for that, Rob. It's very positive. Yeah. I'll chat with Kate, sorry, rather than Nana. Yeah. Uh, I've got Sheila on email. She says, this is a question for you, Anna. She says, I live alone and make meals in advance to freeze. Why does a packet of pasta say, do not reheat? Rice is the same. Well, rice is different. Pasta, you can reheat, mm -hmm. but rice um, is quite dangerous. If it's not cooled down properly, you could actually give yourself food poisoning. So, yeah, I would definitely say use rice that you need, eat it, or leave it as a cold salad, but don't reheat it because it's far more dangerous, yeah. Hmm. But pasta, you can reheat pasta. Yeah. Okay. Um, Vicky, I don't eat meat and I'm sick of the usual substitute meats. What do you suggest as an alternative? Oh, my goodness. You've caught me off guard here. I was like, <laughs> where do I store my... Um, I mean, let me think. There's, I like the idea of increasing flavour in a dish. So, obviously, if you don't eat meats, you eat lots of vegetables and things like that. And did you say she doesn't like uh, uh, meat replacements? Yeah, so the usual substitute meats are out there at the moment. Some of them are really good. There's a lot of uh, really good stuff I on I had scrambled egg ackee the other day. It's like fruit, and it was absolutely delicious. Oh, God, I'm glad. They tricked me <laughs> completely. I thought oh, well, it was egg I'm and so it wasn't. delighted to hear that. That's great. I mean, there's so many people who are so passionate about reducing the amount of uh, meat and fish that they eat that it's incredible how the market changes all the time so there are some really brilliant uh, products on the market but if you don't want to eat um, a meat replacement um, adding extra flavor if you caramelize something you will change the flavor of as I'm sure you've heard of car caramelizing broccoli or burning yeah. broccoli is delicious so it gives it a more um, uh, a dominant flavor so that it feels more satisfying and if you it's add good. things like yeast flakes yeah. or you know they can give you a more complex flavor more acidity to it it's, it's really gives delicious. it the taste well, that you need Lovely. great mm. I'm, I'm definitely hungry now <laughs> thank you so much and that is all we have time for this morning thanks to all our guests Anna thank you Michaela and Kate for joining us and thank you to you for watching yeah, tomorrow Rav Wilding will be here looking at how you could be scammed during lockdown, so don't miss that. And if you're on furlough, we'll be putting some of your biggest worries and concerns to one of the brightest business brains. Well said. See you tomorrow. <laughs>